Hi everyone, I'm going to do the three tarot cards for the week now. It's a little bit later in the day because today got awfully busy and it was beautiful. I ran into some people I know and that was all good fun. So tonight I'm doing it by candlelight. Look, <laughs> I've got the candle, I've put some put some cards out, I shuffled them ran randomly and there they are. So what we've got is for the start of the week, for tomorrow and Tuesday, we're looking at creativity, imagination, romance. <laughs> Could very well be that somebody tries to charm your socks off <laughs> and um, enjoy it. Take it as a compliment, even if you're not interested, it's okay to go, thank you. Um, and leave it at that if you are interested, wonderful. So from what I can see here, yeah, it's also a good time to use your imagination and your creativity, especially in your work. It's a really wonderful time to express those qualities in whatever you do. Most jobs or work, you can use some creative thinking in. So use that. It's, it's a really good time for that. Also, um, yeah, for any kind of healing emotionally, if you've been through a rough time, it's a lovely time to just do nice things for yourself and soothe yourself. Self-soothing is wonderful, you know. <laughs> There's nothing quite like if you've had a rough day having a bubble bath with some nice essential oils and some candles and some soft music, you know. Self-soothing. Absolutely fantastic. The middle of the week, we've got the King of Cups, which is actually a really nice male figure if you look at it literally. It's somebody who's got their act together, who's in touch with their emotions and their feelings. So if that is you, well done. If it's somebody you know, it's a good time to have a chat with them. If there's something on your mind, have a talk. If you've got somebody there who's willing to give you some really good quality advice, so trust that person um, and let them give you feedback, let them give you some ideas. So. It's, yeah, once again, emotionally actually quite a happy time in the middle of the week. There are a lot of feel-good factors and some good people around you. A lot of kindness. And we all need a bit of kindness sometimes, you know. Life can get quite hard sometimes. So, yeah, let people be kind to you. Let them help you. Let them support you. And enjoy it and say thank you. It's not always up to you to give. It's nice to... Let other people do that sometimes too. So that's Wednesday, Thursday really. Um, yeah, it's a nice time to get connected with somebody who is a very genuine, strong and calm person. Um, towards the end of the week we've got justice, which means because it's in the positive, we're looking at some rewards for everything you've been doing, like good karma, so to speak. There's some nice things about to happen in your life which will reward you for all your previous good deeds or just for being kind to somebody else. You know, there'll be nice rewards coming back to you. There's, yeah, just something positive in the works towards the end of the week. So enjoy it. Make the most of it. There's some surprises. Um, a pleasant outcome to something you've been waiting for. So that's really wonderful. So yeah, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, next weekend look absolutely magical. So make the most of it. It's actually a really good week from what I can see here. Um, there's quite strong emotional elements. We've got two cards of the cups suit. So that's indicating emotions and feelings, but they're not bad ones. They're deep, but they're not bad. They're actually quite nice and quite kind so yeah and some nice rewards some goodies good karma um it's a wonderful thing so have a really beautiful week everyone i hope you really enjoy it and see you next time